G'day guys, it's James here from Line Out Drain Solutions. It's been a few inquiries about uh, how do you import a shape file into either your T30 or your T40 controller. So I thought I'd just give you a quick video, show you how it's done. It's pretty simple once you know how like everything is. So let's dive right into it. Uh, so we're in Google Earth Pro. Uh, we've already created uh, this polygon here using the polygon tool up here. Uh, so now to convert it to a shape file, we just need to save it to start with. So I'm going to save it onto my thumb drive because it's an easy spot for me to find it. Click save. So then if you Google search convert KML to shape file, it'll give you a few choices. I prefer to use this program here. Simply drop the file into there. Click open. Okay, now click convert and download. Open that folder, select all of the files that it's put there. Uh, go to your thumb drive or micro SD, whichever you uh, prefer to use. Now, if you haven't done this before, um, you must create yourself a directory called DJI. And then under DJI, you must have another folder called Shapefile. And simply paste those files into there. Remove your micro SD or uh, thumb drive and put it into your controller. So we've just uh, stuck our Shapefiles onto our uh, USB. So you can either use a, a micro SD or a USB, simply plug it in, start the Agris app, so it will automatically find what you're after, uh, so you can either import uh, 2D reconstruction, so if you're doing um, terror reconstructions, etc, that's where you'll find it, however we're doing shapefiles, select on our test shapefile and import. Okay, so then you can then go up to your fields. Here's our test field. And then you can go in and edit it as you like. Uh, confirm, use, set your water rates. Um, you can modify which way that goes, your swaths. Anyway, uh, that's about it. Hope that helps.